guys, it's Sarah and welcome back to my channel. Happy New Year! I know it's been a while since I uploaded and I apologise but I'm back better than ever and yeah I just thought I would film a video. So Happy New Year everybody, I hope you all have a better year than last year and yeah let's hope soon coronavirus has gone but I mean, we will soon find out considering we're in a third lockdown right now, but yes. So anyway, for today's video, I thought I'd do the new year tag. I know it's a bit late because we are already nearly at the end of January. January has gone so fast, it's absolutely ridiculous. But I thought I would do it just to kick start my videos again because January is still the first year of the, the first month of the year, so I can get away with it. <laughs> But yes, I'm going to jump straight into the questions. I just got these from Google. And yeah, let's jump into the video. So the first question is, three words to describe last year. Chaotic, isolated, <laughs> and sad because a lot of people have lost lives. Um, but yeah, that's literally all I can describe last year because we didn't have much of it, so yeah. Number two is, what was the most memorable moment for you of 2020? And like, it might not be a good thing, but the only thing that I can really think of, if you think back to 2020, is lockdown. Like that's gonna be memorable for everything, like the pandemic, the whole lockdown situation. That's what everybody's gonna think about about 2020. Um, so even though it's not a good memorable moment, that's basically what it's gonna be. Number three is, what was your most played song of 2020? Um, it's probably got to be a Covid song because the amount of times that I've stayed at my sister's for lockdown so she's not by herself, we have been playing Covid songs left, right and centre so it's got to be a Covid song. Number four is, did you take any trips in 2020? Tell us about the most memorable ones and why. Absolutely zero. We had Germany planned, we were going to tour around Germany. That got cancelled, everything's cancelled so no, I've not been on any trips in 2020 as probably none of you guys have either. <laughs> Number five is something you're looking forward to this coming year, probably freedom because literally like everybody can relate. We've not had a lot of freedom this year and that is one thing that I'm hoping we're gonna get this year is a bit of freedom at least. Number six is what is your favourite meme of 2020 and it's gotta be the one that um, it goes coronavirus. That one, it made me laugh so much. Um, but yeah, that's my favorite meme. Number seven is, what is the hardest thing you went through in 2020? And I think this thing that we're all still going through is probably like one of the hardest things that everybody can relate to is obviously the coronavirus pandemic because literally like losing loved ones is like the hardest thing ever. And also not being able to see everybody that you want to see and stuff like that. So I think just in general, the whole of 2020, was the hardest thing that we all went through. Number eight is who or what are you most thankful for throughout the last year? And it's got to be that I'm most thankful for all the NHS staff because, and the key workers, because without them, people, I mean, I can't even describe it. I think you guys will understand why I picked them. Number nine is what is the most funniest thing that's happened last year? Um, I'm not sure, I'm not gonna lie. Probably just like, the banter that me and my sister have had to help each other <laughs> but yeah number 10 is what is your what was your favorite series of last year um i watched too much netflix and i don't think i had a favorite i don't think i watched oh blood and water that was my favorite and i need season two to come out on netflix so if everybody wants to go and watch blood and water just for me just so that they'll release season two, then that'd be awesome. Number 11 is what societal events or news stories shocked you this year? Coronavirus, that's all I have to say. Number 12 is what are you hoping for less of this coming year? Lockdown, hopefully like we can completely get rid of this virus and lockdown won't be happening and I can actually work. So yeah, <laughs> number 13 is what are you hoping for more of this coming year. Traveling, because we didn't do any traveling last year, apart from obviously to Brighton when we were allowed to, but literally I want more traveling, more spending time with friends, family, and freedom. So yeah. 
Number 14 is what personal goals did you achieve in 2020? I was in lockdown for the pretty much the whole of 2020. All of us were. I couldn't achieve any goals. <laughs> Number 15 is what is your favourite YouTube content creator in the last year? Um, I probably watch tons of Joey Graceffa gaming videos because of Mongols that got really popular and I love watching them type of videos. So, oh, TFIL. Oh my god, like they do the best series ever. TFIL is the one, guys. TFIL. Number 16 is what are you stroke did you do for New Year's Eve? I spent it with my mum, dad and sister because my sister is in our support bubble and we all stayed at mine and we just celebrated it with a little family party. It wasn't exactly a party because it was only four of us and we went on Zoom with my auntie and uncle and we let the new year in together. So that is what we did. Uh, number 17 is what was your most memorable New Year's moment running outside watching the fireworks? I don't... Just like the whole of it. Like, we didn't really do much because we couldn't physically do anything. So, yeah. <laughs> it's the hard, that one. Number 18 is where is your dream city place to celebrate New Year's? I've not really thought about that. I kind of just celebrate it with my family, to be honest. Number 19, did you celebrate New Year's with a kiss? No. <laughs> And the last one is in 2021, what are your goals? Um, to travel more, hopefully, fingers crossed. Spend more time with family and friends. And yeah. So that is it, everybody. That is my video for this week. If you want to join along, answer the questions in the comments section below. That'd be super awesome. And yeah, thank you for watching my video. If you enjoyed this, please hit that thumbs up and hit the subscribe button if you are new and i will see you next week you heard it here first next week with another video thanks for watching guys bye